Wanna know how to create these 5 beautiful designs using a toothpick and with the slight help of a q-tip? Keep on watching and I'll show you! Hello beautiful people! About a year ago I posted my very first toothpick nail art tutorial and you guys loved it so much! I still get a lot of comments asking for more toothpick designs! And how could I say no to you adorable little sunshines? So here's another episode of the toothpick nails. We are making mini mouse, sugar skull, kittens, sheep, and a hypo! So let's get started! To keep your nails healthy and beautiful, always apply a base coat first. The first design we are making is this adorable hypo. Start off with any background color of your choice. I'm applying a layer of white polish for the base. Once it dries, I'm going over it with a neon yellow. I usually do this trick with neon colors because they just pop so much more on top of white. To outline hypo's shape, choose a light blue polish and make a circle on the bottom half of the nail using the polish brush. Take a darker shade of blue and draw an oval shape across the tip of the nail like so. Time to call our friend, a toothpick! For small dots you can use the tip of the toothpick, but for larger ones you need to trim the pointy end away. If your toothpick has this triangular shape like mine, cut it across first. Then snip away this corner and you're left with a great tool for larger dots. Dip it in the light blue polish and make little dots on the left and on the right side of the oval shape for the nose. We also need to give some ears to our little buddy. To make the dot larger, you can dip the toothpick into polish, then let it dry, dip it again, let it dry, and so on until the blob of polish is big enough. Next, take a white polish and make two larger dots for the eyes and two little black dots inside. On the tip of the nail, make two white dots for his teeth. If you like, you can also add two little dark blue dots on the ears to give them more depth. To finish the design, apply a layer of fast drying top coat and you're all done with this cute hypo. He seems like a baby hypo to me, don't you think? Anyway, I just love, love, love this design. Next, we're making this scary skull design. <laughs> just kidding. Let's rather make a nice and happy sugar skull. Again, I applied white for the base and then a fluorescent yellow on top. In the bottom left and right corner of the nail, make little triangle shapes using black nail polish brush. This will give you that perfect skull shape. For the eyes, I'm using a Q-tip dipped into pink polish. Such perfect big dots would be hard to achieve with a toothpick, but a q-tip does the job perfectly. Make a second dot and we have the eyes. For the nose I'm making 4 black dots, you can just make 3 in a form of triangle. That's the usual, but my skull is a bit freaky, so I just went with 4. Let's give the skull a big smile by first outlining the shape and then connecting the dots. We'll come back to the smile later when the polish dries, in the meantime we can finish the eyes. Make tiny black dots all around the edges of the eyes, leaving a bit space between each dot. Now dip the toothpick in silver polish and make dots in these empty places. Since this is a sugar skull, feel free to decorate it however you wish. I'm making a little flower using silver and green. To finish off the smile, make two rows of small white dots on top of the black patch. Just look at these beautiful shiny white teeth! Seems like our skull did good with brushing them. Seal your design by applying a layer of the fast drying top coat and you're all ready to rock this sweet sugar skull. It is perfect for the upcoming Halloween, but it makes a great accent to your mani on any ordinary day as well. Let's continue with this lovely kitten's design. I chose a medium blue shade for the background. Next, make a stripe across the tip of the nail using the nail polish brush. I chose a pink to make the design more girly. Time to bring on the kittens! Dip the q-tip into white polish and make a dot which represents cat's body. Add another dot right on top of it for cat's head. Finally, make a thin stripe for the tail and two little dots for the ears. Ta -da! First kitten, done! Make another cat, this time using black nail polish. When drawing a tail, it's better to just slightly touch the nail with the tip of the toothpick and then carefully drag it. This way, you'll get a nice thin line. Since my kittens are in love, I also drew a heart on top by making two dots and extending them downwards. Apply a layer of the fast drying top coat to bring your design together. I think this one is just too adorable! 
Minnie Mouse design anyone? This design is so girly, pretty and very easy to make. Start with any background color of your choice. I went for a very light baby blue shade. Make a red stripe across the tip of the nail using your polish brush. Dip the toothpick into white polish and make a few dots on top of the red. I had space for 5 dots on my pinky. This design already looks beautiful, but to make it even more mini appropriate, draw a mouse shape on the side of your nail. For the large dot, I cut the toothpick almost in the middle, because that is where toothpick is the widest. For the ears, snip away only the tip of the toothpick. For a bit more classic Minnie Mouse French manicure, you can use a nude polish for the base. Here I decided to draw a bunch of mouse heads only on my ring finger as an accent. That's how you can always make countless variation from one design idea. Just switch up the colors and voila! You have a brand new and unique nail art every time. Last but not least, let's create this very easy but lovely sheep design. Start by applying two layers of green polish for the grass, which is sheep's favorite dish. To draw the sheep, simply dip the toothpick into white polish and make several dots close together as if you were making a fluffy cloud. I'm gonna draw three of them, so three clouds for me. To give your sheep a head, make four dots forming a triangular shape like so. Then add a pair of eyes to each sheep using a white polish. While waiting for this to dry, let's draw some legs to our fluffy friends. With the tip of the toothpick, make four short lines for each sheep by barely touching the nail. Lastly, make a teeny black dot on top of each white eye for a more realistic look. If you want, you can also draw some flowers on empty spaces like me. I went for three of them, two pink and one blue flower. One flower for each sheep. How cute does this one look? I love all the animals, but sheep are definitely one of my favorites. And baby lamb? Oh my god, don't even get me started, I just love them too much. In the end, apply a layer of the fast drying top coat to give this cute design some shine and protection. And that's it for today's nail art tutorial. Give the video a thumbs up if you want me to film another episode of the toothpick nail art. Also, don't forget to tell me in the comments below which design is your favorite. Thank you for watching my videos and for all your support. It literally means the world to me. I heart you and I'll talk to you soon. Bye! You don't have to visit a professional salon to get beautiful nails. Be your own nail artist. All you need is a nail polish, some creativity and a toothpick.